everyone who's joining. I'm going to wait for some of you guys to get on here before I start talking or getting into anything. And then we will get started. Hey, Brittany. Hey, Lori. Hey, Tina. Hey, everyone. So we're going to be doing a full face. Um... A full face of glam so um, I'm gonna be using mostly the Morphe products really quickly before we get started for you guys who are already on here if you guys can do us a favor and share this live video um, usually we want to try to get about a hundred shares but if we can exceed that that's the bomb so um, share as much as you like share on your pages share to any other makeup groups you may be following it's appreciated. Hey, Seraphine from Malaysia. Thank you guys who are sharing already. All right, so I don't have anything on my face right now, so we are going to start from scratch. I'm gonna try to do it as quick as possible so I'm not taking too much of your guys' time because I know that's valuable, so. Thank you, Pinky. Hi, Kay. Welcome, Alba. All right, and I'm gonna be trying out this new collab by Morphe with Orpha. Um, it's a lip combo, so we're about to try that out. It's my first time trying it out, so. We're gonna fingers crossed that it works good, you know? Hi, Gladys. Thank you, Flora. Hey, Pinky. Hi, Carolina. Okay, so I got some of you on here now, so I'm gonna go ahead and just start. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and skip out on color correcting. Um, we are just gonna go right into the actual makeup. Thank you guys, thank you guys for sharing. Please continue to share. I'm gonna try to zoom in a little more so you guys can see well. Armani. Thank you, Ahmad. All right, guys, so I'm gonna be going in with just my good old trusty MAC foundation because this is like an everyday foundation for me and I like it, so. We're gonna stick with what we know. Hello, everyone. So, I usually will apply it with like a brush and then I'll go in with my beauty blender. So, that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I am gonna try to get through this pretty quickly, guys. I will also still be trying to read the comments and try not to miss any. Um, if you ask me a question and I do not respond or I don't see it, Feel free to ask me again. I'm going to try to keep up with this and with you guys. So, Hey, Justice. Gorgeous. Our little video queen over here. And I am going to be doing a full face, guys, so I'm going to go a little heavier on everything as far as my face makeup because we are wanting just like full glam. I'm not using any primer today. Um, my favorite primer, though, is by Veil Cosmetics. It is the bomb. All right, so we are going to start. We just got like a map of some sort going on over our face, guys. From Malaysia. Hey, everyone. Welcome, everyone. How don't you mess up your eyeliner? We're going to get to eyeliner. We're going to do some liner, so. Thank you, Paula. And um, for my brand, my foundation is Matte Cosmetics. I don't have a picture of the primer, guys. Um... I will try to, I have my beauty page really quickly. 
um, in the description to this video I do have both my beauty page here on Facebook tagged I also have my Instagram tagged which I'm super active on um, there I post all my makeup looks and I also post details of everything I'm using so if you can feel free to follow me on those um, I would really appreciate it but um, if you ever have any questions feel free to send me a message and anything with products or anything like that I'm happy to answer so I'm going to go ahead and just start blending this. And normally I will do some mild color correcting. Um, because this is going to come off right after, I'm going to kind of pass on it today. Justice is bomb. I know. I know, Bessie. She, she the bomb. She the bomb. I told her she's our video, our our video queen over here. Justice, we want to be like you when we grow up. I'm sorry guys my hair is just crazy too because it was in a bun but I felt like I kind of looked like a dude when I had it up in a bun so I was like let me not let me take it down the foundation guys is MAC cosmetics I did also recently try out the Marc Jacobs and let me just say that's bomb too bomb but that's a little pricey so I'm gonna chill on using that for now <laughs> this is a beauty blender hey Sophia okay so sometimes if I don't get enough coverage on that first one I may go in and add a little bit more just to certain areas. I don't like this stage of like just having the foundation on and nothing else because like my face looks, my face be looking so flat. Thank you, Savannah. I actually had them pierced, so I do have permanent scarring, which isn't cute. But I mean, I got to work with it, you know. I got to work with it. I mean, at one point, I guess I thought it was cute, so. <laughs> Clearly. Hey, everyone. Okay. Keep me talking, guys, so we don't go through these, like, awkward silences. <laughs> And I usually will bring everything down to my neck, even like my contour, shade, everything goes down to my neck. I always say like I can't be having like a $100 face and a $2 neck, so. I like it, bestie. Thank you. What do you guys think about using some glitter today? I was going to go for some liner maybe i was thinking some glitter what you guys think thank you kaya the brushes i use are actually uh primarily or honestly let me not even say primarily i use mainly just morphe brushes for the most part i may th throw in one or two other ones but Thank you, April. Yes, everyone, please share this video. Let's see how many viewers can we get up there at once. You guys going to help help out and hook us up with some more viewers up there? Now, now they take a while to, um, it depends, honestly. Mine took a minute to heal. Thank you from sharing over in Malaysia. 
All right, so there we just got the basic, the basic down. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my concealer. I'm gonna use the Tarte Shape Tape. I'm in the shade, I'm not in the shade, but I use the shade Light Medium for my highlight. From the Philippines, thank you, Andrea. And I just highlight any area, not any area, I highlight under my eyes, my T-zone, brighten up a bit. <laughs> Thank you, Michelle. Hey, Patty. Thank you, Joanne. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and just blend this in with the other side of my beauty blender. We're at 1.2K, guys. How many more can we get? I mean, can we get like 1.2K to share? Is that something we can do? <laughs> Thank you, Sess. Thank you, April. Hello, Fernanda. <laughs> Thank you, Brianna. I'm trying to not miss your guys' comments. Ooh, that just brightened. That just brightened that right up. Thank you, Justice, for the pin down there. Guys, my Instagram page is pinned down at the bottom. If you'd like to follow me there, that'd be, that'd be pretty cool if you could. Thank you, Melissa. From Greece? Hello. Hello, darling. Hello, darlings. Yes, this is the Tarte Concealer, the Tarte Shape Tape Light to Medium. Thank you, Mary. Okay, so once I have the concealer on, blended, blended, I'm going to go in with my translucent. I am using the RCMA translucent powder. It's the no color. It is bomb. I've tried a lot of translucent powders and this one, honestly, like I've been loving. Honestly. From Mexico. Thanks for joining us, Ceci. Prayers, because I know there's like tons going on out there right now. Hello, Brazil. Guyana. I'm not sure if I pronounced that right, but. Welcome, Ivy. Trinidad. We got a lot of places up in here. All right. So basically, I'm just setting anywhere where I applied the concealer. Um, once I set that, I will set the rest of my face with a powder that matches more of my complexion. Um, not so much to add coverage, but just to kind of, you know, tie everything together. Cake this face up a little more. And whenever I set the rest of my face, I don't brush it into my skin. I kind of press it into my skin. That way I don't move my foundation around. Madi, welcome love. Thank you, Diana. 
Thank you so much. All right, so we've pressed that into the skin. I will do a bit on my lids. I'm not from Fresno. I'm close to Fresno though. Y'all from Fresno or what? You guys my neighbors? Thank you, Neron. My hair is just crazy. I'm sorry you guys have to witness it. <laughs> All right. So now um, I'm going to actually wait. I'm going to throw a little bit of a contour on just so my face don't isn't over here looking like an egg while you guys are trying to look at it. Like you guys don't want to look at like look at an egg shaped face. So I'm going to help you guys out. I'm going to hook you guys up so you don't have to see this egg face. From Nigeria, welcome Nigeria. Hi Maddie, hi Janelli. All right, so I'm just kind of like, not even so much contouring right now, but just like bronzing, trying to bronze it up a little bit. So I have a little bit of dimension in my face. Costa Rica, welcome Texas, okay, so we're just throwing a little bit of color back into the skin, that's all. Thank you Carmelina, <laughs> my voice, honestly. Thank you, Nazneen. Um, honestly, I've always hated my voice, especially like in videos. For the longest time, I didn't want to record any videos. I hated hearing myself in videos. I just ended up accepting it because I was like, I mean, I sound like a 12-year-old boy, but it's good. <laughs> uh, bestie, I'm going to do... um. I'm gonna do probably some wing liner and some glitter, some glitter. <laughs> yes, welcome to all you guys. And I will go through my contour at the end once my look is done to kind of tie it together. It looks like I contoured my nose like crazy, but I swear I didn't. Let me just add a little bit more in here. Just some more depth. I look like I just gave myself a nose job or something. <laughs> Exchange with your voice. Let's arrange that. Alright, so I'm going to kind of just buff that out a bit. I got my nose over here looking like I got a nose job, so. Suzanti, hello. I'm going to do some wing liner, I believe. I think I'm going with wing liner. And then I'm going to do um, some glitter. That's the plan. This brush that I use to contour guys is the Morphe M551. I like it. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and go into the brows. I'm gonna take I, I'm gonna take my dip brow in the shade Granite. Is it S Sadiq? Hello, Sadiq. Feel free to correct me if I'm saying it wrong. Um, I use the MAC foundation in the NC35. The contour I use, guys, is the Benefit Hula. So I'm going to buy, I'm, I'm going to buy, I'm going to grab a smaller, um, hi, Danielle. Ooh, my leg hurts. About to cramp up. I'm over here sitting like I'm in kindergarten, guys. <sighs> the struggle, the struggle. 
All right, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna do this side really quick and then I'll focus more on this side for you guys to see. Get these brows out of the way really quick. Really quick. Cause I mean, I'm over here looking bald right now. Thank you, Maddie. Hi, Eunice. Honestly, um, Caitlin, I follow my, I follow like the bottom lining of my brow, pretty much like the natural shape of it. Um, if I'm going for like a super defined arch, I will add that. For the most part, I do my brows more of like a straight brow. Um, Yes, Bessie's in here too. Um, but for the most part, like the bottom, like I follow my natural shape. And then I do more of like the adding to shape it out at the top of the brow. I usually don't like to steer too far from the natural shape of my brows, so... Okay, okay, bro. Coming through for me today. My brows, like, sometimes I'd be having, like, a love-hate relationship with them where they're like, no, today you're not going to be cute. <laughs> We're getting somewhere. Hi, Gabby. All right, guys, what can we get these views up to, though? Really, like, how many more shares can we get? And what can we get these views up to? I mean, can we get them up there? I know it's evening, so people are busy. Honestly, like, I'm usually really busy in, in the evenings, but... Hey, Priscilla. Hey, Kiki. Thank you, Elise. Elise. Alicia. I don't be having the best size, guys. Like, my vision's kind of bad. So, like, I'm trying to, like, focus um, to see if I can, you know, like, see the comments good. Okay, so I'll focus a little more on this side for you guys to see. Like I said, for the bottoms, I pretty much follow my natural, my natural line. And then I add towards the top of my brow for my definition, you know, my arch, my arc. I have a habit of like slouching down, so I'm trying not to do that. There we go. Thank you for the shares. Be right back. Madi, you better be right back. <laughs> All right. I'm sorry, like, it's so quiet, guys. Like, I wish Facebook didn't have this rule where we can't have music. It drives me cray, cray, cray. Because, honestly, like, when I get ready, I need music. 
luckily like I can hear a little bit in the background. Um, what I use right here is the Anastasia Dip Brow. This is the shade Ebony. I usually use dark brown for the most part, but since I've dyed my hair darker, I've been gearing more towards this um, granite color. And it's been working. I've been liking it. I've been liking it. All right, so I'll usually spoolie them out a little bit. And then I'm gonna go through and carve them. Honestly, though, I think even whenever you don't put, um, what did I miss? Why would a woman want fake, fake painted on eyebrows? Lacey, this is the wrong place to say that because half the people on here, not even half, a lot of the people on here love fake painted on eyebrows because they're bomb. Anyways, moving on now, moving on now. <laughs> <laughs> I love how like all you guys like come to the rescue like when people try to hate like if you're gonna hate like why like how hard is it to keep scrolling how hard is it to creep, keep scrolling if you don't like something but people choose to take time not to hate instead I mean I don't understand <laughs> thank you Leslie all right so I'm gonna go ahead and carve it out really quickly I just got concealer on my brush and wiped it all off. And for the most part, I don't carve too much on the top. I may carve a tiny bit out at the ends of the brows just to make sure they're more precise, but. And you girls that do all this always look beautiful. I just don't understand why girls want to look like a porcelain doll. I mean, I wouldn't mind looking like a porcelain doll, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I think we all want to look like a porcelain doll. Thank you, Cassandra. Thank you guys for having my back on here. You guys are the real MVP. All right, so we're gonna move on from the brows. The Bratz dolls, yes. Yes, we can be the Bratz dolls. All right, guys, so we got that now. Usually to prime my lids, um, I don't use a primer. I use the NARS. Um, this is the, I think it's like the creamy matte concealer. So I go in with this and I kind of just prime my lids like that.
which I don't need to prime so much because I'm gonna be going in with a glitter, I think, so. Thank you, Aaliyah. All right, guys, do us do me a favor. If you're on here and you have not shared this video, it will allow you to quickly share it at the very bottom. You can click share and you can share directly from your page. It won't navigate you away from the video. If you guys can do that, if I can just get a bunch of shares right now, I would really appreciate it. All right, so now that we have that, we're gonna go ahead and set that. Ooh, I'm gonna use just... Um, a matte white shadow. This is blank type by MAC. And I just go in with, with a fluffy brush and I will kind of just pat this to set that concealer. It's gonna allow everything to blend in better. Just kind of press it in. She my baby daddy. <laughs> Thank you, Kathleen. All right. She my baby daddy. I'm her baby daddy. She my baby daddy. Bad habits said my shirt. Yes, this shirt, it's a crop top, honestly, and I don't really be wearing crop tops, but um, it's from Fashion Nova, guys. Fashion Nova. So I got that done. So now I'm going to go ahead and start building up my crease. I'm going to go in with the Morphe someone doing their makeup and say you're pretty without all the makeup can someone get this child <laughs> all right this palette's kind of a mess right now but we're going to be going in with the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette <laughs> thank you Anna thank y'all for having my back for having my back all right, so I'm going to just go in with a bunch of different shades of browns. Um, everything is going to be from this Morphe palette. Um, unless I end up using something else, I'll let you guys know. So I always start with like the lightest shade of brown that I'm going to use. And I'll start building with that first. Just to kind of start like a base. go ahead and do that on the other side I need the smear to be like higher up oh there we go with the mad faces there we go it never fails it never fails So now I'm going to go in with, <laughs> can you do my eyebrows? <laughs> I'll do all your guys' eyebrows. All right, so now I'm going to just go in. I'm going to just start going in with, I start with the lighter brown and then I'll just keep getting darker to where it's the depth that I want. I think I'm gonna do a bit of a cut crease. <laughs> yes, I remember when he said that. That that's the face they make when they're having a hard time on the toilet. <laughs> Thank you, Crystal. All right. 
So we're going to keep digging in with darker tones. I might throw in a little bit of like reds in here too, guys. Yes, Sam, I love him too. He's bomb. He's so talented and he's like, his lives are always so fun too. Always spreading positivity. So I'm going to go in with another brush that's a little more precise to start adding in a little bit more depth to this. <laughs> Thank you, Samantha. His laugh is hella, his laugh is great. Like his laugh makes me laugh. It makes me want to laugh. It's like such a happy laugh. What did April say? Not fun in this vibe. I love down to earth people. Are actually positive. I mean, I'm pretty down to earth and I'm pretty positive, so. I'm trying to focus a little more like this so you guys can see it better. Come to her. Where's your cosmetology classes at, Gabby? And I'm not doing anything different right now, guys. I'm just getting darker and darker with the browns that I'm using. Darker and darker. tickling me. I'm hungry. I honestly, Liz, I probably use like five different shades of brown so far. I just grab and then I just keep adding. All these shades are from the Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette. All of them. All right. 
So now, this brush is similar to the last one I was using. It's not as dense. I'm going to kind of just use this to buff this out a little bit. Is her name Maritza or something? Because I get that all the time. All the time. I don't even know what she looks like. I never watched that show. I've meant to and I just haven't. So now that we got that in there, I'm going to go in with another like fluffy brush and add like a, a little bit more of like a lighter brown shade just to throw some color back into it so it's not just straight dark. Um, I'm in California. You're in New York, so you're about three hours ahead of me. Um, I can't see the time right now on my phone. But we're three hours behind you if you're in New York. Yes, I'm going to do a bunch of Halloween looks this year. Got like a fuzz in my nose or something. Um, I got Halloween looks. I'm going to probably start sometime next week, hopefully. I got a lot of plans for Halloween, so makeup wise not in real life I don't do nothing so <laughs> so now I'm gonna go ahead and carve this out guys I'm gonna just carve this out with this itsy tiny brush you know what let me make sure I got all this fluffed out So I'm going to carve it out with my NARS Creamy Concealer. I always use this to do the carving. You know what? I... No, nah, never mind. I'm going to... Mm -hmm. Zoom in a little bit. I might have to use this mirror to do this. And I do have small lids, so I do bring it a bit above my crease. I'll kind of start like a guide like that, and then I'll go make sure that nothing's going to transfer. I just basically created a bigger lid for myself because your girl got no lid space. I got no lid space. So just like that, we're going to go ahead and do... The same on the other side. You are a beautiful girl, but you... I do not lack personality. Let me tell you that much. You can go back to a bunch of my lives and you're going to see that I do not lack personality, okay? But, I mean, whatever you think, you know? If you want to come on here like with your negativity, you're really irrelevant. So, girl, I got tons of personality. Let me just tell you. You don't know me personally. So, so.
and I stated in the beginning of the video, I will probably miss a bunch of questions because if you can see, I'm trying to do my makeup here. So I'm gonna answer as many questions as I see. And I stated that if I miss something and someone wants me to answer it, they're free to ask me again. Trish, honestly, these mean people don't bother me. Like they don't got nothing to do if they wanna sit here and be a troll on Facebook. Bet you she met me in person, she loved my personality. I guarantee it. Cause I will be cocky when it comes to my comes to my character because I got hella personality. <laughs> yeah, is she over there hating. I don't know. Like, there's so much ugly in this world going on, you know? Like, I don't know why people got to add to it. Like, there's, like, so much... There's already so much going on in the world, you know? And people just want to... Like, you think with all the shit that goes on, people would want to, like, be kind. But they don't. It's all good though, cause it doesn't phase me. She said, and your girl Armani isn't helping. <laughs> Thank you, Joanna. Honestly, that eyebrow video, like the whole credit card, like people took that too serious. Like honestly, like it got reposted on this page and like I got so many hate comments on it. <laughs> I got so many hate comments on that video, like it was hilarious. Like, did she really use a credit card? Can you see? It's a it's a credit card, clearly. <laughs> Honestly, it just it's just funny to me. It's just funny to me that people have to go like out of their way just to hate on people, you know. It really doesn't make any sense, like, I really don't understand. <laughs> Honestly, I've been carving this out for a minute, though. Like, I don't even know why I've been carving this out so long. <laughs> I don't even understand me right now. Alright guys, can we get some more shares on here so we can get some more people up here? We're going to go ahead and start adding the glitter. So, glitter is always nice. I'm going to go with this glitter. It's by Eye Candy Cosmetics and it's called Candy Corn. You can kind of see it. I don't know. I haven't used it before. Thank you, Bonnie. <laughs> Keep going. Bye, Felicia. I always do that. I always mean to pour someone with how to do this. <laughs> Thank you, Leticia. Thank you, everyone who's sharing. I appreciate the shares. All right, so I'm gonna go in with some of this and I use this adhesive from Eye Candy Cosmetics. It's called Liquid Sugar and it's a, I don't know. It's like an adhesive. <laughs> so your face is not all negative in future. Okay, I'm sorry for the loud background guys. People don't understand that I'm recording. Hey, Sheila. 
Hey, you guys are loud. And I can't hear. I can't hear. I can't focus. <laughs> I can't hear. Like I'm hearing you guys or something. <laughs> Can you guys stop being so loud? <laughs> That's my mom arguing with my little brother. Thank you, Jamie. Thank you, Stefan. Thank you, Marianne. Or hello, Marianne. All right. So I'll usually, um, I'll dip my brush in this adhesive and then from there I'll dip it into the glitter that I'm going to use and I'm going to um this adhesive honestly like I really like but lately it's been kind of like I don't know a little off but and then you just pack it on like that And I'm just packing this all over the lid. I don't really need to bring it out here so much because I'm going to have liner that's going out there. Thank you everyone who's sharing. I try not to get too much fallout with glitter, but it's hard. have no patience. Alright. So, we're going to go in with the other eye now. Do the same thing. How's everyone's Thursday going? I know we're all on different times, so some of you guys like it's like super nighttime. Some of you guys it's super nighttime where you're at. And we still got daylight, a little bit of daylight over here. A little bit, just a little bit. You guys can kind of see through the back, I think. I'm sorry guys, I feel like I'm missing a lot of comments. I'm using the uh, Morphe and Jaclyn Hill palette. And the brushes I use are from Morphe. Most of them are from Morphe. Friday afternoon. Thank you, Lorena. 10 p.m. I'm liking this glitter though, like. It's like a gold, but not like just straight gold, you know? Got a little something else to it.
I'm just, you guys can see, I'm just like packing more and more of this glitter on. Nevada. Yeah, I think, um, Nevada, you're on the same time as us. I'm in California. We in the same time zone. Alright, so usually when I use glitter, guys, honestly, like, I like to use a liquid liner. My liquid liner is, like, running low. Yeah, you dip it in the adhesive, then dip it in the, um, glitter. This is running kind of low. I'm going to try to use it. So don't fail me now liner liner i'm gonna go ahead and do this eye first and then i'll focus on this other eye for you guys and we are going to do more of a dramatic wing don't run out on me liner not today Tomorrow you can run out on me, but not today. It's wanting to run out on me, I can tell, but... I think we got it. Mm, Nicaragua. Thank you, Haiti. So, this liner is starting to dry out on me, but I think we could still make it through the other eye. I think we should be good for the most part. I do have kids, Carly. I have two boys. I have a nine-year-old and I have a three-year-old. I need to, like, get some of this liner out. Mom, don't play me now. Oh, there we go. There we go. All right. I hear a weird noise coming from outside. I am 28 years old. How many of you guys are, of you guys are from um, California? How many Californians we got on here? I think it's raining. Like the weather here in California has been so weird. It's not even funny. Ventura, California. <laughs> Everyone always thinks I'm a lot younger than I am. But yeah, I'm 28 years old. I have two boys. But I think once my makeup's done, I look more like my age. I mean, I guess I can't complain though for looking younger. I know it looks like I'm going over my liner a lot, guys, but this is drying out a bit, so I just want to make sure it's not skipping at all. From San Diego. Isabella from San Diego. You know what? I'm trying to get out there. Not in San Diego specifically, but like in LA area. Like, that's where I'm trying to move. 
can I just come live with someone who lives over there? <laughs> Lakeside? Oh, in Tennessee now. Huntington Beach. I was just kind of like in that area not that long ago. Michelle, girl, you're like my neighbor. <laughs> Are you going to try for a girl? Eventually, I do want to have a girl. When I'm settled down and... In like a healthy, happy relationship. But yeah, I want to try for a girl. For sure. I feel like I have to have a girl. Like, I'm too girly to not have a girl. Of course, like, if I had another boy, I'd be fine. I feel like with my luck, like, I'd have... I'm gonna have nothing but boys, honestly, I feel like. Yes, everything is so inexpensive on there. You thought I was 40 or 50 years old? I'm not from Modesto, Michelle, but I'm pretty close to Modesto area. Ow. My foot keeps getting sti stick stuck to what I'm, the chair I'm on. So now after that, I'm going to go in with like, like a flat brush. This is almost like a definer brush. And I will kind of carve out the lighting to where my glitter starts. I'll try to do it in here so I'm not blocking you. And I just did that to kind of carve it out a little bit more. I hope someone didn't really think I was like 40 or 50. I think that has to be a joke. <laughs> Please don't let me look like 40 or 50 right now. Kind of looks like Egyptian a little bit, huh? You got a throwback 80s party? That'll be fun. All right, so I'm going to go in with... Um, where's the brush I'm trying to use? Why are you hiding from me now? I don't know, but, oh wait, here it goes. So, I'm just blending out that line I just created now. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Just a little bit. If I was on, I don't see it. If I was on the East Coast, I would definitely have you there. <laughs> Thank you, Nikki. Yeah, it is kind of like a little Cleopatra look, huh? Honestly, like, I didn't know what I was going to do coming on here. I knew I was going to probably mess with some glitter. But I was like, hmm, what are we going to do today?
my glitter like I want a little glitter crazy over here though <laughs> a little glitter crazy Where are you, what area are you from? I am from California, I'm from Northern California. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and add in some shading to my bottom. Hi, Bianca. Some shading to my, your phone, my kids always take my phone. I'm gonna add some shading to my under eye. I'm trying to think like if I wanna pop a color on my under eye. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I pop a color? Or just keep it with the browns? We can throw in some reds. <laughs> Hi, Marisol. Blue. I kind of thought about blue because there's a bomb blue in this palette. But you know what? It may clash too much with the lip color I'm going to use. So I'm going to just kind of keep it with the browns, I think. Red, let's do reds. I'm still using this Morphe palette, guys. I have not geared away from this palette, so. Some reds in there. <laughs> Bestie, are you on here still? I was going to ask her something. Um, the glitter I'm using is from Eye Candy Cosmetics. I Candy Cosmetics. Their glitters are really good and they offer their own glitter adhesive too, which is like a liquid that you can try out too. I'm not going to lie, the adhesive is kind of giving me problems lately, but I don't know if maybe I just need a new one. I got it at the beginning of this year though. Can you do a look with red glitter? I have a, if you go on my Instagram, it's tag at the bottom, my Instagram name. Um, or it's pinned at the bottom. If you go on my Instagram, I just did a makeup look on my other live the other day. But the look is posted on my Instagram and it's more of like a copper red glitter. And the glitter color is tagged too. If you want to check it out. Alright, so now that we have that, I'm going to start adding like a shimmer red to it too. Thank you, Lindsay. <laughs> you don't want to move honestly like I'm starving right now like I need dinner so can you make me some too can I come over for dinner if anyone wants to invite me over for dinner like invite accepted <laughs> I'm such a foodie like I just love food like, I love food all the time. <laughs> Hi, Star. That's a pretty name. Over here, I can't see the time, but I think it's around 7. I'm actually going to be recording a, a makeup video after I'm done with this, so... Christina, <laughs> thank you. All right, so I'm gonna go in. I've never tried this liner, but they like gave it to me as like a freebie at Sephora. It's just a Sephora, Sephora brand liner. I'm gonna take this in my waterline. Mm, pretty creamy. That darkened my eye up. 
I'm not gonna lie, I made my eye water a bit though. I make like a hella ugly face when I'm doing that. Um, I use the MAC Studio Fix Fluid um, Foundation. I like the Marc Jacobs one though. The new Fenty one that came out is bomb too. It's nine, I live in Houston. <laughs> yeah, it's seven over here right now, there we go. From Thailand, hello. All right. So we got the eyes down, done, whatever, for the most part. So I'm going to take a fluffy brush and I'm still going to kind of fluff out the shadows up here. In Virginia, yeah, you guys are three hours ahead of us. Thank you, Tashi. Um, honestly, my skin, I don't have dry or oily skin. I would say for the most part, my skin is pretty, like, I guess normal or, like, combination for the most part. I tend to get a little bit oily in my T-zone. Thank you, Bessie. Bessie, I was going to ask you, do you remember when we used to use, like, the CoverGirl, um, we used, like, the CoverGirl eyeshadows that came with like the four shades and we thought like we were so badass <laughs> they were like the blue the matte blue the like icy blue like the metallic blue like we thought we we're we thought we were the bomb selena's i'm taking a long time now because i'm talking and i'm engaging with you guys <laughs> bessie we thought we were like the shit and we weren't no, nah, we were though. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and highlight my brow bone. I'm gonna use that palette still actually. I don't like how I slouch like that. Like, I need to stop. I'm using the Morphe and Jaclyn Hill palette. This palette, honestly, like I love it. It's definitely my favorite of the Morphe palettes. Ooh, I got a cramp in my leg. Armani, <laughs> Bessie, yes, I remember when you plucked everyone's eyebrows. Let's not go there. Let's not go there. Because you plucked the shit out of mine, too. And they never fully grew back at the end. All right. North Carolina. <laughs> Chola brows or nah, Sharpie brows or nah. <laughs> I love Italian food. Thank you, Lucas, for 20% off Morphe products. Use Nikki. Nikki. All right, all right. So I'm going to go ahead and curl these lashes, guys. Pop some lashes on, finish my face, and call it a night. Everyone's mad at me now, but y'all happy when we did it. I'm not gonna lie, you did jack up my brows. But, like, to us, like, it was cool probably at the time. No promos, okay. I'm not going anywhere. Is there another Arm... Oh, wait. There's another Armani on here. Armani Thomas. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to the shower though. <laughs> I 
I'm going to the shower though. No, I'm gonna take a shower and then I also have to record a makeup tutorial for my Instagram that hopefully I'll have up probably sometime next week, maybe in the next couple days. Yes. All right, I'm gonna pop on some mascara. You know what I just noticed, guys? I never bake under my eyes, and I just noticed I never dusted off my setting powder, so I've basically been baking my under eye, <gasps> which I hate baking on myself. So let's hope. Let's hope it's all good. I used the MAC foundation, the MAC Studio Fix Fluid. I used the shade NC35. I don't like baking on me just because I feel like it's a little drying. I feel like when I bake on my under eye, it, it makes me feel super dry and like tight under my eyes and I don't like how it feels. It looks pretty, but I just don't like the feeling of it. I don't like feeling like I have a lot of makeup on my face, if that makes sense. Because you dry, bitch. I am not dry. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and put on these lashes. I'm using, I think I grabbed, these are goddess by coco lashes i actually really like these lashes for whenever whenever i have liner on i feel it adds to the look and it just kind of like goes with the liner like like that little swoosh I feel like I need to go, what does it mean to bake? Ah! I, can, I have to be like so careful because I don't want these um, lashes to rip from me like taking off the glue. Because if they rip, I can't use them again. And I want to. I want to use them again. All right. You know what? I actually want to get a nose ring. I want to get the hoop though. I might do like a double hoop, like the gold hoop. I had my septum for a long time. I had my septum done twice. So I'm either debating on getting the hoop nose ring or my septum done again. What do you guys think would look better? Septum or hoop nose ring? Hoop, gold hoop, hoop, hoop. What are these mad faces for? You know, we're not even going to acknowledge it. Never mind. So I'm going to have to wait a few seconds, let that get tacky a little bit. Yeah, I'm thinking the double hoops too, guys. Thank you, Chris. We're going to tie this together, guys, and call it a night. I'm like playing music in my... The nose job... 
I came here for a reason. Someone ask me, please. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. The glitter I used, um, Autumn, is called Candy Corn, and it's by Eye Candy Cosmetics. Selena Gomez. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go ahead and apply this one. I think the end got a little dry, so I'm going to just dab a tiny bit on. And I'm going to go in with, actually, let's try to do this on this mirror. So you guys can see. So once I place it, I always get my finger and I kind of squish it together with my real lashes. That way they blend more just because I don't add mascara to my falsies. Some people do. I personally don't like it, like to do it. Um, so instead of using the mascara to smash them together and to blend them, I use my finger. I use my finger. Like that. Is there a trick to how to put your lashes or does it just take practice? I think it just takes practice for lashes. Get them as close to your lash line as you can. Um, my brows, I use the Anastasia Dip Brow in the shade Granite. But yeah, for lashes, I definitely think it just takes practice. But once you get the hang of it, you're good. So I'm going to do the same thing, like I said, I'm going to press them together with my real lashes to blend them in more. These tweezers are playing me right now. It's a, Anastasia Dip Brow is, um, it's a gel, like a pomade. I just seen a message pop up at the top of my phone and I already know it's going to be something crazy. <laughs> I'm hurrying, Marjorie. Hi from Malaysia. I 
don't even want to know what the Maria just go for it honestly all you can do is just go for it you'll have fun as long as you engage with people you'll have fun don't take any hate personal all right I'm so sad that I left this under my eye area for so long I'm so sad about it. But I guess it's kind of good because it'll allow all the glitter, any fallout, to like dust off. I don't have a YouTube channel yet. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and add some bottom mascara. Thank you, Danielle. I'm trying to like, well, I guess you guys don't really care to see bottom mascara. This song stuck in my head and I can't stop like singing it in my head. This is the Buxom mascara. Black is black. I hella like this mascara. Thank you everyone. Alright, so now I was told you shouldn't pump mascara like this because then it puts air into it and dries up. Really, you know what? That might be true. Danielle, just go for it. You might mess up the first time, but the lashes are Coco Lashes, and the style is um, Goddess. I'm going to go ahead and add my contour. So it's not any nice. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Hi, Arizona. Lucy, I'll put my hair down, guys, um, in a second. It's just that whenever I usually put my hair up because for some reason, reason, whenever I have my hair um, down, like, it makes my face super light. Like, it does something to the lighting. It's weird. This is the Morphe M551. I always use this for my contour. It doesn't make it super precise, but if I want it precise, I can go in and cut it out with um, powder. Dairy Northern. Dairy Northern. Hello. Santosh. Hi, Sunny. I just saw you join. My little boys are at their dad's right now. They're not home with me right now. They'll be back in my arms tomorrow though. You could just get color matched, Danielle. <laughs> All right, so I try to use this little mirror like it's gonna do anything. 
and then I always kind of go like this just to tie the lighter area together um, I am gonna carve out my face a little bit carve out my contour a little bit just to make it a little more dramatic I think I'm just gonna leave it like this, you know? <laughs> Kidding. All right, we're almost done, guys. How many of you guys can share this before we end? We're like super close to ending, so. Someone said earlier that I reminded them of Selena Gomez after looking at me. Um, I've been doing makeup for a long time, Jesse. Um, honestly, I probably started playing with makeup when I was like, um, probably like eight. I've been doing weddings and events for probably like five, five, six years. No, I would say like five, six years maybe. And I've been certified as a makeup artist for like maybe two years. Which brush is that? That's the brush. This is the brush. This is the Morphe M551. And I'm so weird like I'll do like little like adding at a time um honestly Terry that might just be the powder I usually don't get the flashback whenever I take photos though it may be the powder that you're using I did a Pocahontas look a couple years ago <laughs> I used to always get told I looked like Pocahontas when I was little I see it called Pocahontas too. All right. So we have that. Um, I'm not going to add on any blush today. Um, I'm going to spray my face and then I'm going to add some highlight. Oh, the other one, the white brush is the Morphe M527. That's not even open. <laughs> I love how that feels, like, just like amazing. I need to not use a bunch of this like I'm going somewhere. Um, I'm gonna use the, honest, if you've watched me before, you know I love my Anastasia Sun Dipped Glow Kit. That's what I'm gonna highlight with. I am gonna do lipstick. I do my lipstick last, cause I do add a highlight to my upper, to my Cupid's bow. Cupid's bow. I always got to have me a little button nose. A little button nose. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I add a little bit up here. I'm using the Sun Dip Glow Kit by Anastasia. The shade I'm using is Summer. I am Hispanic, mainly Hispanic, yes. The highlighter, guys, the highlighter is the Anastasia Sun Dip Glow Kit, and this is the shade Summer in the Glow Kit. Good morning. It's morning where you are. Why are you spray? It's not water, it's a setting spray. Finishing spray. All right, 
so after I do that, I don't like my highlight looking chunky, so I always go through with like a fluffy brush. And I just... Like that. So, now that we're done with that, I usually take... I don't have... Um, I'm gonna have to use this shirt. <laughs> oh no. Oh well. Um, I'll take like a wipe, like a makeup wipe, and I'll take off like any powder I may have on my lips that came on like there through like the process. I'm only using my shirt right now, guys, because. I don't have a wipe around me and like it's just convenient <laughs> okay so I'm actually gonna use the um, this was a collab between Orpha and Morphe it's a it's called vinyl and it is a lip liner and a liquid lipstick duo thank you Jessica thank you <laughs> all right so I haven't used this yet but the color is bomb and I love her so I was like I gotta try it got to. so I'm gonna follow my natural lip line for the most part actually in some cases I may overdraw a little bit but we'll see <laughs> These might have to go to crazy. I use um I use RCMA translucent no color powder to set my under eye. So I'm guessing that I'm going to overdraw a little bit. Just on these sides. Now I'm going to go in with the liquid lipstick. Thank you, Star. It is a Morphe lip liner. It's with the, um, it comes with the, um, the lipstick. This color is like... This color is bomb. I want to say this set is 18. It includes both the liner and the lip color. This color is beautiful. This 
this color is like bomb. I like it. I'm liking it. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take the hair down. Hopefully this don't get too crazy though, because it makes like the light like super blindy when my hair is down for some reason. I don't know why. I don't know if it's the color of my hair or what. My hair is all crazy too guys because I had it in a bun all day, like in a slick back bun, so it's not gonna be cute, but someone asked me to take it down, so I'll take it down. Ooh. <sighs> I do, I do. They've been in here for a minute though. Let's like try to like bring some life back to my hair. <laughs> it's not gonna happen. I can't bring no life into this hair right now. I had a edge wax in and some hairspray, so right here is going to be pretty slicked. <laughs> Thank you, Angelica. Honestly, my hair is a pain, though. Like, it drives me crazy. And it's, like, super fluffy and, like, frizzy right now. It's not cute. I'm sorry. Let's kind of throw it to this side. keep it on that side thank you guys it's all it's honestly like it needs to be brushed out like it's not cute right now but we are done though I'm trying to like make it look decent but like it's not gonna happen like if I had a pin it may look okay but my makeup is natural <laughs> Oh my leg. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. Selena. Anything for Selena. I meant to do a Selena inspired makeup look. I'm going to still do one because I have a bunch of Selena, um, of the Selena collection from MAC that I want to give away. So. Close up, yes. Um, I have five tattoos. Five tattoos. I'm so sorry about that, guys. I had a call come in really quick. Okay. So we're going to do a zoom in. If you guys can see. So again, we use the Morphe um, Jaclyn Hill palette for the eyes. Um, lashes are Coco Lashes in the style of Goddess. Um, and the lippy is this is the first time I've used the Morph uh, Morph lip, Morphe lippy. This is the vinyl collab with Orpha and Morphe, and it's bomb. Honestly, I love it. I love the feel of it too. It doesn't feel dry or anything. You're my lost sister. <laughs> I don't really use a lip gloss plumper. Um, I remember using one from, from Victoria's Secrets and I liked it, but. Um, but that's about it, guys. <laughs> Honestly, usually it would take me a lot less time, but like I talked through it and I kinda, I didn't know what I was gonna do going into it, so. This lash is like playing me. Don't you dare play me right now because I haven't even taken a picture of this. <laughs> and um, if you guys can please, at the bottom, my Instagram is tagged. If you guys can please follow me on there. I'll be posting. I'm not going to post it tonight because it's kind of late. But tomorrow I'll post this makeup look. And I will post, um, I will po uh, post a full breakdown of the products I used. This lash thinks it's going to play me. Not today. Not today. Whew. I'm in my eye water. Whew. 
I kept my eye open for heck along, so. Okay. Why don't you try red lipstick? Okay. <laughs> Thank you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We are done. So, um, again, Instagram is listed at the bottom. Thank you for watching this. If you still wanted to share it in case anyone you know might want to see it, you can still share it because the post is, or the video is still going to be available. Probably, I would assume it's going to continue to be available. So, um, thank you guys for watching. Let me kind of zoom out because, like, I'm all up in your guys' face. Okay, like I said, be sure to check out the details tomorrow on my Instagram for this look. Full product breakdown. Um, if you aren't following or you don't like Makeup Goals page, you need to like it because there's like always bomb posts. There's tutorials. There's lives. There's like pictorials on how to do like different eye looks. Like we got all kinds of good stuff for you guys. So all your beauty stuff, beauty needs, makeup, hair, nails bunch of stuff is posted here on the daily so if you don't like the page and don't follow it you need to <laughs> all right i'm gonna get going guys thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you guys next time